welcome to M Squared TechCast, a love show offering the latest news and interviews with the people driving business, technology, and politics in Michigan. Hey, it's Mike Grennan. We're at the Benziga Cannabis Capital Conference. I say that fast three times. And uh, I'm with Mike Elias, who is the CEO of Common Citizen. And uh, they're building out a big grow operation in Marshall. Is that right? Tell us all about it. Sure. So we're a vertically integrated cannabis operation in the state of Michigan. Uh, we were awarded 45 licenses in mid-November, which is the largest issuance of licenses to date in the state. Um, we are vertically integrated, which means we manufacture, we process, and we provision uh, pharmaceutical grade cannabis uh, through our distribution channels. We got about 10 retail locations across the state, one of which is up in Flint, Michigan today. If you go to commoncitizen.com, you can see that. Um, and then our Marshall plant is about 1.2 million square feet. 200,000 square feet just went up. It is a hybrid greenhouse that takes the best of data centers, data center technology, takes the best of agricultural greenhouse technology and brings them together to create what we call a hybrid greenhouse that allows us to completely control the environment, but at fractions of the cost, because we get to leverage the sun where most indoors can't. And so we have the ability to really compete and use the economies of scale to really bring the price per pound down without ever compromising quality. All right, so the other thing that you do is a little different is a lot of people just don't understand whether they're having insomnia or medical issues or they just want to get a buzz on. They don't understand the various types of cannabis products out there, and you guys explain that to them, right? Well, that's a long uh, conversation. There are so many different ways to deliver and consume cannabis, and the diversity in the different delivery systems are really a result of just a myriad of different ways uh, that patients need to consume. Some folks who I have CPOD, COPD, uh, can't smoke or can't vape. Um, some who have colorectal issues can't digest. Uh, some who have both, some sometimes they'll go to patches or transdermal patches to get the uh, medicine into their bloodstream. And so there's just a, a wonderful array of different dis distribution methods, including lotions, tinctures. Um, obviously, everybody knows the basic flour and edibles and but but for the most part um there, there's just a lot and uh, it continues to grow all right so if folks want to reach out to you find out more about you do you have a website commoncitizen.com it is a purpose-driven human-centric brand we don't worship the flower we don't worship plants it's about the people and reflecting the communities that we're in if you can't see yourself in our our chapters then we haven't done anything to normalize consumption uh, most of our interactions at the retail level are 45 minutes long because we cater to the 88 percent that don't have a clue how to use cannabis or what it means to supplement their medication schedule or sleep aids. So we really are catered to, to those who have no clue. Yes. All right. Again, that's Michael Elias, CEO of Common Citizen, and we're at the Benzica Cannabis Capital Conference. Thank you so much for your time. Appreciate it.